Woo. Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. <laughs> Guys, it's game day for the Ravens today, but it's game day for all of us brothers and sisters in Christ on Team Jesus every day as we play on this big field of life right here playing against Team Lucifer, but we've already won. Jesus is our MVP. Go out, catch a touchdown pass from him and run it in for the touchdown, and that's what we're going to do today, guys. Real quickly, as the Ravens um, put the ball down, as the Ravens come together, clicking on all cylinders, right? Offense, defense, punting game, kicking game. Um, we need to come together as brothers and sisters in Christ on Team Jesus. Champs for life. If you don't know, now you know. Hallelujah. I just want to say thank you to my beautiful cousin Paula, your beautiful Christian sister. Send me this all the way from Maryland, Baltimore City, baby, holding it down. And we're flocking together, baby. <laughs> as Ravens fans, but mainly as Jesus fans, guys. Team Jesus is the team we're on, and we must all flock together. As the Ravens fans flock together, right? We need to flock together as Christian brothers and sisters, right? Praise the Lord. And thank you, Paula. It's so nice. I love it. <laughs> oh, man. I had to hide it because Karina was running around the house looking for it with a pack of matches, trying to burn it, being a Lions fan. <laughs> But back to the message at hand. It's so cool, right? Praise the Lord. Thank you. I got my Bible out. Bible open up in the morning. Bible open up in the evening. I believe every word I'm reading. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Thank you, Gary and Sherry, for my beautiful bookmark again. The little things in life, man, mean the most. But Hebrews chapter 10, we're going to go there really quickly. And it's all about teamwork, guys. As the Ravens have made it this far in teamwork, right, we need to be working together as brothers and sisters in Christ, uplifting one another, being there for one another, keeping each other prayed up as the Ravens, right? Again, they got each other's backs on the field. We got to have each other's backs here as Christians on Team Jesus on this playing field of life, okay? And we need to flock together. And the scripture the Holy Spirit led me to was Hebrews chapter 10, verse 25. Not forsaking the assembly of ourselves together, as in the manner of some, but extorting one another, uplifting, encouraging one another, and so much the more as you see the day approaching. Wow, praise the Lord, guys. Listen to me. This means simply that the, Lord, the day of the Lord is approaching, right? And we need, until that day comes, we need to be here uplifting one another as the Ravens uplift one another. Ray Lewis would be in your face. Come on, man, let's go, right? However you do it, do it. Take time for your brother and sister. Uplift them, okay? And let's flock together, man, because this is what we need to do. We need to be flocking together, y'all. Hallelujah. As we as we approach game day and uh, game, uh, game time, I should say, for the Ravens today, every moment of the day, we're in the game of life. They, they got four quarters. We got a lifetime, and I just want to say I love you guys. Keep motivating one another. Keep encouraging one another, and just keep iron sharpens iron, okay? Let's flock together. Hallelujah.